I am Millie. Today is October 5th, y'all. And I was supposed to be starting this whole 31 days of working out, eating clean. I don't know if y'all can tell by my voice. I sound horrible. I have a cold. Because, you know, we live in Mass, Massachusetts, and the weather is finicky. So, mind you, it's going to be hot the rest of this week. Not that that matters at this point. But it's okay. Um, I don't feel horrible, but I just didn't want to chance it and go outside and worsen it. So, I did um, still have all intentions to start today. Whether that's just eating well, maybe taking a walk later. If that doesn't happen, so be it. I usually start on Mondays anyway, but today's Zumba day. And I was going to document all that and... So I had a class and blah, 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 but such is life. Um, I just don't want to chance it and worsen it because I still have to work this week and stuff. And I don't want to get the kids sick. I don't know who got me sick. I don't know where it came from. Again, it is what it is. I'm going to uh, document. I'll show you my groceries when it comes to see what I'm prepping for the week. And um, we'll go from there. Yeah, we'll go from there. So, um, when the groceries come, which is going to be later on tonight, I'll show that. Couldn't get a fresh order sooner. I'm probably going to have some trash breakfast and lunch today, but I'll make an effort to eat okay. We'll see. We'll see. Bear with me. I'm acting like I'm not true to this and new to this, but... Bear with me. I'm, I'm going to gather myself and get this right. Because this... That's what I know has been real. Because when... You, first, I've been big for a very long time. But when you're... You can't even angle the camera a certain way and everything to hide what has happened to you. It, it's like, okay, enough is enough. Enough is enough. And I'm actually fed up and tired of it. So... Just, just, you know, j join the ride. Today's October 1st again. I'm going to try this for 31 days. Not try, I'm going to do this for 31 days. And see where that goes. I'll see y'all in a moment. Why is it 1.41? And I'm just now getting out that bed after I spoke. Hungry as ever. I'm about to show you what I'm about to make. Get out! Out! Oh, you weren't supposed to get it for yourself, but nobody else? She said she's making a big bowl. She just needs to find it. She can put it in that? What? Mm -hmm. Get the lid right there. I'm going to make some eggs, bacon. I'm going to make some bacon, egg, and cheese tacos. I'm going to set it up, and then when it's done, I'll show y'all. All right. We're going to use the Mission Zero Net Carb Sun-Dried Tomato Basil Tortilla Wraps? Is that what they call it? The taco wraps. Tortilla Wraps. Some Moonster Moon Man, let's get some cheese. Holy grail. With this in your eggs? Game changer. There's some onions in the pan. Bacon's in the air fryer. What else am I putting in there? I think that's it. I'm gonna make me some iced coffee. The Zion's over here. Really? Why are you eating some soup, Juni? That mummy made. She did send some down for us. Yeah, that's for later. I already had my heart and mind set on the eggs. So that's what I'm gonna eat for now, and I'll eat that later. Cord? What? Man, you can walk past. That's speeding. Okay, that's 
First off, it's not even that. In Haiti, y'all don't eat that often, so why are you acting like it's different here? Oh, what bread? What bread? I don't have bread down here. I have bread for toast. Okay, the iced coffee. This is what I put in it. Probably about to show you. Guess what? I'm tired. As far as the breakfast goes, I should have just made one egg, but there's bacon in there. Some onions. And the, um, that chili sauce from Trader Joe's. That's probably why it's a little dark because of that. Because it crisps over really fast. But that's it. Okay, so I'm back in the bed. I'm trying to give myself like 20, like 15, 20 minutes. And then I'm going to get up to clean up. Because I vow for the next 30 days to do what I need to do on the weekend. Like, first off, it's Sunday. So, which is great. It's the first of the month. It's great to reset, you know, the house. Put clothes away. Get the kids ready for the week. I still have to do uh, Bria's hair um, and clean up. So I'm going to get up, put all this laundry away, which is folded, thankfully, and clean the kitchen up, clean the bathroom, mop those two floors because the main floor, the kids are here. So I won't do that till later on tonight when they're in bed um, and probably put my workout clothes on to do my walk-in until I get back acclimated to jump into the gym so for the next 30 days the goal is to do Sunday reset well the weekend reset so basically getting everything ready for the week ahead I'm gonna focus on work during the week opposed to cleaning and cooking during the week I'm gonna not meal prep I do not like meal prep so I'm not gonna meal prep but I am gonna cook I'm not gonna eat out or buy food out um, cause if somebody else buy it, I'm eating it, but I'm not going to buy it. Um, we'll get into one of my addictions at some point when I get a little more acclimated. So I'm not going to out myself. If you know me and watch this, you know what my addiction is. But I did say yesterday that I was going to relax on that for the next 30 days. We'll see. And then it's nothing crazy. It just costs a lot of money. Um, then... What was the other stuff? And then, of course, the the health stuff, which I started off with earlier today, was that I'm going to eat better. I'm going to move my body every single day, whether it's walking, Zumba, getting back straight into the gym, because I truly love the gym. It's just I lack pure motivation. I don't know what has been going on with my weight. Again, I'm using this as a video diary, so I'll express my concerns, sadness, annoyance, whatever, anger about it. I feel like I know what plays a part in it, but I don't want to assume and jump the gun and, you know, stop taking certain um, medications or whatever because of it. But I will start incorporating my vit vitamins every single day. I will show that at some point. Um, but yeah, so basically eating better and moving because the cold turkey at this point in my life is about 36. I'm, I'm not doing that. But I am going to eat better. I did, again, I did see, I'll show y'all the groceries that I bought for the week. Um, and I'll show you my meals every single day, um, as I remember. And we'll see how it goes. But the whole goal is to truly move, because that's what I've been lacking the whole summer going into the fall now is movement. So I am going to start moving. It's going to be beautiful weather-wise in Boston for the week. So I'm going to utilize and take complete advantage of that before the weather drops straight to hell. And we'll go from there. Um, I know I have support. I'm not worried about that. But I need to legit have faith in myself. So the goal, again, is to move. Move and eat better. Ooh, and drink water. Oh, I've been slacking. I used to be so good at that stuff. But I've been slacking. Hey, Want to know what time it is? 741. Okay? Told you I was going to come in here at like 3 or 3.30. Fun fact, I'm a procrastinator. But it's okay. I'm gonna get to it. 
still early in my book. I'm about to clean the bathroom, then we're gonna move on to the kitchen.
down a little bit down thank you we got a new stocking cap I need to refresh one in here first All right, all done. All right, so one kid's, well, you last saw Breeze here got done. She showered. She's in the bed. The rain sounds are on for her. Um, Ziggy is in the tub. Too late as ever. But he'll suffer that consequence in the morning. Um, I still gotta mop the floors. Everything else is done. Uh, I'm gonna mop it once he's done. That way, nobody's walking on it for the night. Well, minus my rodents, i.e., cats. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna do that last so the house could be, you know, fresh for the night. So I have no distractions tomorrow because I will use that as an excuse to not do anything. I eat, eat on time. Um, start work on time. Go for my morning walk because like I said earlier, it's going to be very nice. This Wash and fold it. Uh, what else is left to do? So that's it. Just fold these, put these away. Should have been done hours ago, but we're not going to talk about it. Like I said, I'm a procrastinator by nature. Um, I'm going to finish this regardless of what. 
not tired, so that's why I'm still up doing this. And I actually have to wipe my mirror and dresser and stuff down, but I wanted to change my sheets. So I'll just do that. That'll be the last task tomorrow, because that's easy and quick. So just wipe the dresser down, wipe the mirror, the TV, you know, do all that extra stuff, and then change the sheets. So I'll just do that tomorrow. It's not dire, it's just... Just to get in the swing of everything being clean all at once, I'm just going to do it. Yeah, so... Um, yeah, I was going to say goodnight, but I'm going to show y'all the, uh, the house spot list. And I'll end it after that. And if I keep talking, I might keep Bria up. She's still in here for hopefully another week. Yeah, because the wall's getting done in Ziggy's room. We're not even going to show y'all that. But the walls are getting done. And she's going to be in there with him. And out of my room. I finally I could push my bed off this wall. Can I hear her? She's reading a book, which is fine. She gets up a little later than Ziggy, so that's okay. This towel is ruined. So just wait. Yes, Bria. Let me see. What? Which one? That's a raspberry. It's not the color of a normal raspberry. That's why it confuses you, probably. It confuse you? Where? I have your sheets in your bag for school already. Yeah. But you're prepared for next week because everything's washed. You need to lay down, Mama. Thank you. I ain't gonna hold you. I'm hungry. And naturally, I have a bowl of cereal, but I don't have milk. Oh, and they canceled my Amazon Fresh order. So, tomorrow we'll be at the grocery store getting the things that I needed to get. Which I kind of easily went to the grocery store today, but we're not going to talk about it. I'll just go get it tomorrow. It'll be here tomorrow. If I waited and did another order, it would have came late tomorrow evening and I want to cook tomorrow. So, we'll just do it in the morning and I'll take everyone with me. Well, you guys.
morning. I look like yesterday, but that's okay. But as promised, something happened with the Amazon Fresh order yesterday, but that's okay. Um, I'm going to show y'all what I ran and got at our local grocery store and to prep for the weekend stuff. So, pack of chicken tenders. I use this for a lot of stuff. They cook really well. Um, what's the air broil option? In the air fryer? Amazing. To go over salads or make wraps or whatever. Or sometimes I make like some type of Asian. What is the meal I usually make with the chicken thighs? It's like a, I can't think of it right now, but when it comes to me or if I can make it, obviously we'll see it. Got some chicken wings to prep for the week. Feta cheese, I'm making some feta pasta today for the kids and I. I got some honey crisp apple, my favorite apple. Some sweet potato milk, cause your good sis love her some good honey bunches of oats with a banana. A pineapple, some kale, um, some red cabbage to add to some salad. Growing a lot to go with the good yogurt. Some sweet butter lettuce. Uh, some baby spinach. I plan to eat salad almost every day. And then I'll add some spinach in my eggs. Maybe kale too. Maybe once or twice this week if I have it. I'm not really like a fiend for eggs. I love egg sandwiches. But I have to leave the bread alone a little bit. I got more cherry tomatoes for the feta pasta. If y'all have ever had that, it requires feta cheese and cherry tomatoes, but I'll show you that later. This is, this one's for the salads. Some Caesar dressing. That's my new favorite Caesar salads. So, some Caesar. I wanted the shredded ones, but the grocery store didn't have it. Whole Foods, I think, is the only one that sells the shredded ones. And Amazon Fresh, obviously, they didn't have it. So, I, I'm just, I'm not driving all the way over there. Some bananas, which we'll put in here. Some croutons. I'm not going to use them whole. I'm going to beat them a little bit. To, I just want the crunch. So I'm gonna, when I take them out to make the salad, I'm just going to beat them down a little bit so I don't use too much of them. Uh, and a cucumber. Some juice. That's for the kids. Well, Bria. And I think that's it. Yeah, so when I'm prepping the meals and stuff, I'll pick y'all back up. It's actually 12.10. I'm failing miserably on time, but I'm having this with some peanut butter. I'm putting this in the oatmeal, which is right here. And I'm going to have me some peanut butter toast. That's just how I like to eat it. And I have some fruit over there. I hate cold fruit, so I put it in hot water. Judge your mama. Did I mention jalapenos? I put these in eggs, tuna. I'm not going to put it in my salad, but eggs and tuna. I think I'm gonna make some tuna this week just to stay accountable and make sure I eat lunch because I do not. I always miss lunch. It's 10 o'clock now and I haven't eaten breakfast yet. And I won't until after I take a shower. I'm gonna open the fridge as I'm putting the groceries away and found some, but they're expired. Oh yeah, <laughs> they're definitely expired. But I'll buy them at the end of the week. Once I'm done with whatever I got, I'll buy a new fresh set. So I prefer this over the whole ones. But we'll see how they taste. Okay. Right. Like, I know. Mm, 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 mm. This is worse than this shit. There's something about mm. going on a date, like, with a dude and how much he needs to spend. Mm -hmm. And she Sounds was like, good. it's not, you know, I don't. I just realized I didn't show my face today. It's October 2nd. I showed my breakfast and I've showed my lunch. That soup is very fulfilling. Very carb filled. Um, I'm dreading cooking dinner tonight. The ki the what did I make it tonight? The feta pasta is pretty easy. It's a one pot dish. Boil the pasta, toss it all in there together. Pretty easy. Um, I think it's just the whole clean up. And... I dread it. But it should, I'm gonna do a little bit of my evening work and get to it. And we'll go from there. I don't wanna do it though. I don't want to. And I still haven't taken my walk today, but maybe around. 6.30ish I'll go. 
We'll see. Because I should be making the food, so I don't have to do any food for the rest yeah, for a few days. But we'll see. I'll check back in if I get up and cook dinner. <laughs> That's funny. Yeah. Can you make the dinner? Yeah. You're going to make it? Yeah. That's the way I make dinner. You're going to make dinner? Here comes your brother. Hmm? Your brother. Ooh. Did I? I thought he was coming in here. Sweet potatoes about to get some of the same seasoning that chicken's about to get. Minus, I put a little cinnamon in the sweet potatoes. Just a little bit. Nothing too crazy. Mama, can you please get undressed so we can go take a bath? Thank you. Sorry about that. Have you ever seen orange pepper before? Have you ever seen orange pepper before? We're gonna put it on the chicken. Mama, can you please get undressed so you can wash your butt? Two times. She's bipolar. Huh? Socks off, please. Pants. Okay, good girl. Let's do some onion powder, and that's it. I already have put some oil in here. Started, oh, didn't put no. The cinnamon that I was looking for so hard. I'm going to stir it and stuff, and then we're going to go from there. This probably gets some um, barbecue sauce on it. I do have some sugar free ones. I think I might use it with a little bit of sweet red chili. <laughs> That's my favorite. Let's check on this. It's probably going to fog up. Let's go ahead. Batty go ahead. Tia's such a cornball. <laughs> so, it's done. Mom's going to stir it. That's embarrassing. Me? What did you say to me? I'm hungry. 
I thought she wasn't hungry. Would you say what else? What else did you say to mommy? I'm hungry, please. No. No, what else? What did you say before that? All right, let's I'm so hungry. <laughs> Doesn't look appetizing, but it is. It is. I'll tell you when I. When you take it from bite. Out, huh? You do what? Mommy. When I devour this food, it's gonna go bye bye. Money. Thank you. What did you think? It was good. It was good? Yeah. Well, yeah, it so? is good. It is good. Obviously, because of life. Dang, our shades are janky behind that. Don't. Who did it? You? Yeah, I did it. Well, I was only eight. I, eight? I didn't eight? know any better. Oh, I did. That was an onion. Yes, Mommy. Yeah, so Mommy. This is the barbecue barbecue sauce that I will put on there, I think. Is it good? How did you not eat today? I saw you with a pack of Oreos. In the morning, I ate the Oreos. You ate them? I didn't. Why didn't you eat no food? You told me you was getting food this morning. That's why I said I only eat this morning. What, school lunch is not good? Oh, even at lunch. I wasn't at lunch. You got detention tomorrow. Why do you keep going to class late? I was not late to that many classes. If the, I was late, I had a pass, so I don't know. Well, dispute that tomorrow. Detention before me? Wow. You just said that like it was an accomplishment. Mommy. Mommy. Yes. Mommy. Okay. It's been about I'm on the clock weeks. still, so. I forgot exactly what I gotta, days, um, it's been about two. Yeah, my dust. My to be honest, days. I don't really eat at the kitchen table. That's for them to do. Um, it's almost nine o'clock. Which is fairly late, but I'm gonna work on it tomorrow, and um, we'll see how that goes. I'm gonna um wait for the rest of the food to be done in the oven. I'm gonna leave it out for a little bit because I'm not eating that until tomorrow. I'll show you that, and now uh, that may be the end of the night after that. Yeah. See you in a little bit. All right, all done. Like I said, I'm going to pair this with some collard greens that was given to me yesterday. I just realized I didn't have a lot of greens today. But such is life. I got to put that away. Got to let this cool down. And thankfully, it's in this, so I could just put some aluminum foil over top of it and store it into the fridge. Because I'm not a container meal prep girl. Because that makes it too strict, I guess, for me. And I don't like meal prep that much to do it. Also, let's walk to my desk. Oh, me and sweets go together real bad, but for this month, I'm trying to let go of ice cream. I get these um, little sorbet, just in an orange. I don't know if it's, okay. it's a real orange. It tastes like an orange once you're done with it. Um, but this helps with the craving. Like, so it gives you ice cream, but it's not ice cream. What is it called? Island Way? I get these at BJ's. It has a bunch of different flavors. So when I get a new pack, I'll show the new pack. But I think this is it for the night. Yeah, I think we're good here. I'm gonna put that food away. I got 15 minutes left to work. Take a shower and go sleep. Cause I gotta go into the office tomorrow. Yeah. It's been real. I'ma have banana. And a bowl of cereal today. My favorite cereal, but not this flavor, the almond one. But I have to leave the house today, so I won't see you guys till later on. I'll try to take pictures on my phone of what I eat for lunch because we're having a baby shower. But I'm about to have this now and head out the door. Hopefully, I can leave in like the next 10 15 minutes. So I'll see you guys later. So I'm not gonna. Two bottles of water. I would show it, but it's in my work bag and my work logo's on there. And then I'm going to bring an apple, an orange, mandarin, whatever they call these, to snack on just so I don't... I was going to bring some popcorn, but I think by the time we get to work and sit down, we're having like a little baby shower. I don't know if it's before or after our regular meeting. So I'm going to end up eating 
wherever they give us. Um, and that's that. Just wanted to make sure I held myself accountable and show that. I have two bottles of water. I already had one. All right. Good morning. It is Wednesday. Oh, okay. Wednesday, October 4th. So, and, and it's 10.05. Been ripping and running. When you're a parent, that's just what happens, right? So cool. Um, I was craving pancakes and a bacon today. Where's the bacon? Where's the bacon? A maple bacon. It's gonna be really sweet. It's okay. Gonna have a couple of those. How many is left in there? Three. We're gonna finish it because after this week, I'm gonna leave pork and beef alone. And then I have some Kodiak protein pancake mix. Pancake and waffle mix. I'm gonna have that. Let me turn the light on because it's dark in me. Yeah, so we're gonna have that. And I'm gonna use, I was gonna put whole milk in it, but I was, my stomach. So I'm gonna just use some almond, coconut. Coconut and almond blend, but toasted coconut, toasted coconut flavor. So we're just gonna use that. I'm gonna put the bacon in the air fryer. I'm gonna make the mix and let it sit, let it settle a little bit. And then I'll come back and show y'all the finished product. I did weigh myself too. I'm gonna stick that in here somewhere for the week because it's gonna be a weekly one. And I'll show you. All right. So I'm back. The bacon's done in the air fryer. I got um butter and I'm gonna get some oil. If you like crispy edges on your on your pancakes, mix butter and oil. Mm-hmm. That'll do it. I got that hint from Chef Risha on, on uh, what you call it, on Instagram. I don't got no measurements for anything. Just wing it, bro. Actually, a nice day in Boston. All right, that didn't work. I wasn't going to have eggs originally, but I don't want to have to be. Snacks on the end I'm actually gonna pair the meal with a banana as well. My orange from yesterday is still there, and I'm gonna have an apple today as well. We're gonna let that melt down. Girl, you ain't no lefty. I hate struggling. Oh, these fruit flies are still around. Well, because it's warm today. As soon as the weather cooled down, the mofos disappear. Oh, you're going to fall into my pancake, you Gucci. They are annoying, though. Or a little bit. I'll hit y'all back when it's almost done. 
look good. I ain't too bad. I suck at flipping them, but nonetheless, they look great. Nice and golden. I'm going to fry my eggs in the same oil. It doesn't taste different. It doesn't taste nasty. And they actually do not taste too far off from Bisquick. But allegedly, they're more healthier. So, that's what we're going to do here and there. I often into not putting the cheese in. I don't really do yellow cheese. Uh, so no cheese for me. I'm gonna go get the um so it's just Carrie's sugar free low calorie syrup. Been using this one for a long time. Make the kids use it to avoid me using other stuff. I don't, I'm not a syrup girl. This is very light. It's not as thick as the um, Aunt Your Mama's or whatever they call it now. I might douse it a little bit, but not too much. For some reason, these pancakes stay hot for really long. So I need this to cool it off and get to work because I do have to work. At least twice out the two days out the week. Yesterday didn't count. I did work a little bit yesterday before I went into the office. Yeah, so I gotta work today. So I'm gonna eat this and I'll check back in a little later. I might turn y'all on so y'all can see me in action, but it's nothing interesting at all. Plus, I can't even leave the sound on because it's personal patient information. So I need my job. All right. That was good. It was good. I usually don't have issues making that one anyway, but that was good. And I had one of these little waters. I have a bunch of them at my desk. Um, I want to take a nap though. So I'm about to be in the fight of my life to not take a nap, but I've been up since 4, it's 11.16. To be fair. I'm tired. I took a shower too before I ate. You can't go, you can't go to sleep, Mildred. You can't. What am I supposed to do with myself? Work? Let's do that. I don't want to do that. But I am. I'm gonna find me some shows to watch so I can just at least finish what I started yesterday so I can have the rest of the week free. I gotta call mad people too. But I don't want to. I want to. I'm gonna do it. Okay, I'm gonna work. I'm gonna work. I'm gonna work. It's nice outside too. I can't be in here asleep. But you know how you have that little like lethargic feeling because you didn't get enough sleep? That's what I feel like. That nigga singing. The joys of having no job. He up there singing and cooking and kicking up there, huh? Walking back and forth. The joys. We won't talk about it. To my best friend. Yeah, my head's on fire. Best wife this tea on King's going on? Crazy. But yeah, my head's not on fire, but I took something for it. But I feel like I need a little salt. So I'm going to have this that I get from um, Trader Joe's, right? Cheddar popcorn. I'm going to have a little bit of this. And we're actually going there tomorrow. So you'll see what else I'll pick up or like to grab when I go there. I forgot to come back. Okay, so it's very childish of me to be drinking these. But it's been easier to kind of consume this over this. I plan to get me a Stanley Cup. 
obviously for aesthetics. Duh, just kidding. No, I just, I'm gonna try it to see. I know it's a pretty inexpensive option because it's just $45. But, um, I don't know. I'm, I'm, I'm not buying it. I'll probably add it to a Christmas stuff so somebody else will buy it. But this, I've already had three. Three. Did I have three here or four? No, I've had four. And then I had like a little bit left of another one from yesterday. I had a little bit of, of this one left. And then, yeah, I've had four. So this will be, I think I just recycled three. This will be my fifth one. And these are eight fluid ounces. So it's basically two of these. This is 16.9. Yeah, so about two of these. Um, I am going to drink this one as well. But I, this has been a game changer. But I usually buy these for the kids. I had bought this particular pack for work yesterday. For um, We had a little baby shower for my coworker. And I was like, let me just bring... I was like, Did anybody want it? Nobody said they wanted it. So I just took it. And I was like, you know what? I'll just drink these because I'll consume the amount quicker. I don't know. Hey, it's working today. This is what I usually buy for my daughter and or son if you choose to drink that. But he usually goes for this obviously but he doesn't drink it all in one sitting it'll be lingering around for a few days you know kids um but yeah i've definitely had this will be for number five yeah this will be number five which is good and it's only one ish so i'm not doing too bad just wanted to come back in and say that yeah i really I want to find alternatives to taking Excedrin for migraines. Does it work? Absolutely. But literally, I was fighting for my life for hours because I was like, you know what? Let me just, you know, fight it off. I was going to take a nap, which wasn't going to be a good idea. It might work. But I was going to take a nap. I was like, okay, I'm just going to fight through it and fight through it, fight through it because I really want to stop taking Excedrin. I really, like, as soon as I feel like a little, I popped in. Because it work. So why fix something that ain't broken? But I really want to find another alternative. I don't know. Because I always feel like when I try my best to eat a little better, I get these headaches. But I know for sure today could stem from like kind of abruptly getting up. And I was, it wasn't even like abrupt. I was cold. I went to like adjust myself. Me and the um, blanket got into a little tussle. And then I had the urge to use the bathroom. So I was like, oh, I know for sure if I get up and go use the bathroom, I'm not going back to sleep. So it wasn't like abrupt. It was kind of like I was up a little earlier than I wanted to be, which is not out of the norm for me. But I did go use the bathroom, came back in the bed, laid down. I adjusted my body. And guess who else was up? Bria. And she's up, up. It's not like, oh, oh, she's adjusting herself. She's sitting up like, I'm like, hey, girl. She's answering, hey, mom. And I'm like, Ugh. she ain't going back to sleep. Literally, I went to lay down for like 20 minutes. Like, I looked at the time. It was like 520 something. Knowing damn why I got to get up or get Ziggy up for six for him to get on the bus. <sighs> so I think that's what really kind of stemmed the headache. If I just had stayed up, I should have just got up and went and found something to do around the house that's what did it that five that measly 30 minutes i was trying to get which is i do it to myself all the time so i just need to move forward i'm just gonna get up and find something to do yeah i should have just had like hopped in the shower like you know woken myself up probably had like a really really early breakfast just a head start to my day because i don't want to pop excedrin pills because my sleep was abrupted uh Abrupted? Abrupt? My sleep? My wake? Me waking up was a little shaky. Shoot. Yeah, so I, I don't know why I just put my head like that because I feel fine. I literally popped the pills, had that popcorn. Literally, I promise you, I put the pill, drank the water, and I felt perfectly fine. I should have just smelt it or something. Maybe that would have worked if I just smelt it. I don't know. But the, it really aggravates me that I kind of like depend on it. Even though I know, like, even the dairy, I had a lot of milk yesterday because I had two bowls of cereal yesterday. That could have probably aided in the headache. No, it's legit from getting up. 
popping up early at like 5 30. But I just want to find another alternative. This is what I really came here for. I just dragged it. I just want to find another alternative or maybe from really trying this clean eating and eating better will maybe help. I know it's going to shake me up a little bit because it's not like I've never done this stuff before. It just, it's been difficult these past few years to kind of stick to it and stay consistent. But I'm trying. It's been a few days. My goal this week was to at least eat. Eat without, you know, opting into just snacking all day, snacking on stuff that's not even... Healthy is not even an issue. It's like, girl, you didn't even eat, but you want to have ice cream. You want to eat chips and all this extra stuff. So, literally, this popcorn was the first. No, I had chips on Sunday. Sunday don't count. But, yeah, so I had popcorn today, which is fine. I'm going to have the um, chicken and sweet potatoes that I cooked earlier this week. Probably for lunch and, like, it's 140. Um, probably, like, 2-ish. I have that and I think I'm gonna opt into a salad this evening but I'm gonna have it I'm gonna try to be done with eating by like seven the latest because yeah seven the latest moving forward like tomorrow for instance I'm taking the Zumba class that I've taken but it just it starts at seven so I don't want to eat once I get home either but if I do have to I have protein shakes like pre-made ones but as far as food food goes I want to be done with that by seven yeah so yeah so i'll probably opt into a salad like 6 30 7 o'clock if work isn't too hectic actually i'm gonna jump on and finish what i gotta do with one job and then jump onto the other job at some point so that way i get a little head start and then that'll be it i'm really upset that i really took that pill and i felt perfect i'm going to bed as soon as i clock out at 10 o'clock tonight i promise you that i'm going to bed Hopping in the shower at like 9.30. Sending them kids to bed right after that. Or hopefully, I, you know, I'm going to send them to bed before that. Just who sleep is sleep. Who isn't is none of my business. I'm going to hop in the shower after them. I don't have... I'm not cooking tonight. They need to figure all that out. Maybe tomorrow. And then... um, What you call it? I'm going to bed. Am I going to stay asleep? Doubt it. But I'm going to try. We'll see. I'll check back with y'all when I get, when I plate my lunch, which y'all saw already. I'm just going to plate it and show y'all. Why is my like that, girl? Let your face go. Well, I got caught up in some other stuff and it's now like 3.30. Great. This collard green is, is very dumpily. I don't know if it was a soup as well, but it was already on my plate. Can't really tell what, because it was like, like solid from sitting in the fridge, but it is what it is. We gonna eat this because I'm way like an hour and a half behind of what time I was supposed to eat prior to this, but that's okay. It's done. All right. So let me see. You don't need no more cups. Yeah, I think it's nice. Come on. We got Target. Bray, I wanted to bake a cake. So we gotta get the rest of this stuff in. Oh Lord, win the toy out. Pass the toy out. You know I owe you a Barbie doll. Let's find you a Barbie doll. Cause I owe you a doll. Barbies? Yeah. That's a baby though. Yeah. It's a Barbies. Barbies. Let's go down. Barbies are down there. Come on, real quick. Let's go. Okay. Target cart. Yeah. Look. Look. Some 
Barbie. That's the one you already had. See another one? Broke my Barbie it's okay. It's okay. I'm gonna get you another one. You gotta pick one. Look up there. Hmm. I wanna use something cool. I wanna use something cool. Mommy, look down there. Mom, look at it. It's so pretty. Yeah. It's so pretty. You like that one? It's her crown. She's so cute. Look at this Barbie girl. I get love. You gotta tell me which one you want, Mama. Overwhelmed, huh? Too many to choose from? I don't think we're going that big now. Mm -mm, we'll see what she decides later. Stop recording. Show them. Huh? Show them. It's Mary Tail Papa. Well, here is a shopping on her. Her hands are like pretty. Have a Ready to go get our cake stuff? Yes. Okay, let's go. Cheese. You don't have to smile, it's a recording. Cheese. You're that happy? Yeah. You are? Yeah. That you finally got your new Barbie toy? Yeah. And you picked a really good one, and I turned the camera off right before she chose. I hope it doesn't look like I chose it for her, because I did not. No, no, no. You made your own decision, right? Are you happy with it? Yeah. And we're going home to bake a... Cake. Yes, we are. Aren't you excited? Yeah. Yeah, last minute I decided, I was like, I, think, I want a cake. Yeah. And we was missing frosting and carrots so we can put inside the carrot cake. Yeah. This is my first time making carrot cake, though. And I bought a new pan. I didn't need the pan, but I think my bunk cake pan is a little too big for it. So we'll see. Hopefully the other pan isn't too little for it. We shall see. It's a small. It's time for me to go because this area is too hectic. I'll see you when I get home. Bye. <laughs> the cake didn't happen. Turns out the box of cakes was expired. So I had to purchase some new ones. We'll do it on Friday probably. I'm still at my work desk and it's 10.13. I clock out at. Good. They, they want me to. I'm getting paid today for my work. Mm -hmm. Sure am. Sure am. It's all good. I want the job, so I'm not going to complain about it, but they... They said, girl, you're going to get paid for your work today. This is the last one, though, thankfully. And then I'm going to clock out. I'm watching. I don't know what happened. I might have lost track of time, but they flooded me today. Call it a night. I might have a bowl of cereal, though. I ain't gonna hold you. Cause I'm a little hungry. All I had was some chocolate chip cookies that Francine brought me in from Cadoba. Since so y'all saw me eat that last meal. <clears throat> so I'm gonna have a bowl of cereal. It's okay. Yeah. I'm probably gonna go to Trader Joe's on Friday. Good morning. Thank God it's Thursday. Um. As I mentioned before, I'm on my way to Trader Joe's. It's 10.30. I tried. I was supposed to be there earlier, but such is life. Um, I'm a firm believer in 
get in there when I get there, as long as I make it there safely. And there's a lot of traffic still, though. I was like, okay, it's later. Maybe I can go. I mean, it should be less traffic. There's still a lot of traffic. Um, but we're on our way there, nonetheless. I have a $100 spending limit because Trader Joe's can get you there. Trader Joe's is like Target for all of us because we all can't go into Target to get one thing. So um, I'll check back in when I get there. All right, cool. Just dead ass in my traffic. All right, all right, all right. Francie's on the phone too. I lied about the amount that I gave myself. And yeah, so the total was 208.59. It was I'm not embarrassed. I'm not embarrassed. I got good stuff. You know, I'm I tr the dumplings was new. The dumplings was new. Um I tried a couple stuff and then I got an extra the maple chicken sausages. Those are so good. So I bought an extra to freeze it. Francine, don't be understanding my logic. It's so good. Okay. And that beef, what is it called? The beef short ribs? Them things are expensive. Them things are $13.99. But I bought three because I got kids and I'm going to feed them that. And then I tried and I got, what is it? Beef and broccoli? That's a new one. But when we get to the house, I'm going to show y'all what I bought. been home for like an hour or some change but it's okay i do have a job you know i'm doing this i'm not gonna have myself on this camera so let's start here um 
I got the pizza crust. I've made the um, infamous burrito taco meat. And there's like a pizza recipe. I think it's on TikTok. Boom. Wasn't there like something going about dumplings? Bought that too. I don't know what the recipe is for it, but... Or which one goes which, but there's two of those in case the kids want to try it. You know, I got 50, 11 of them. I saw this and it looked really intriguing. So we're going to try that. These. Amazing. Remember, I told y'all yesterday that I'm going to leave the pork and the beef alone. Granted, I did get some beef and broccoli, but this is for tonight. The beef and whatever pork is for next week. Excuse me, knocking on the bags. Trader Joe's vegetable rice. Their turkey bacon. I don't even like turkey bacon like that. I've been trying to find one that I do like. And that one is really, really good. So I got some blueberry, strawberry, blackberries. That's what I normally buy when I get my fruit, apples, bananas, or whatever. But these are my three norms. Saw this on the way out the door. So I grabbed that. Not really a juice drinker, so I figured it might be a little light so I could try it. Some jasmine rice. I'm going to pair that with the beef and broccoli. Excuse the mess. We actually ended up at BJ's as well. So I grabbed some popcorners when I'm craving chips. And the second batch of um, chips there are for the children. Of course, the infamous chili, oh, excuse me, crunch chili onion oil. I put this on my eggs. Actually, this tastes really good in tuna, too. It might sound crazy, but this bomb. This wasn't supposed to happen. A lot of the purchase from Trader Joe's was not supposed to happen today. But this looked good. And it probably cur curbs my little sweet craving. So I might as well just pair this with some eggs and bacon or eggs and the sausages and be done for the day. A must have. A must have. This is gonna go down probably this weekend. Cause you know it's a wrap after that. Well not really a wrap. I'm not gonna quit it cold turkey, like because I really like this, but I'm not gonna have you know beef all the time, which I didn't at one point, but these things start to come into play. So it's a here and there thing. So I only go to Trader Joe's like once a month. So this is another norm that I buy. It's really not that spicy, but I like spicy stuff. Um of course, the Berea. I saw this, too, as I was getting the meat. I'm an Oreo lover, so I'm going to try that. But this, I just opened it, as y'all can see. It's so good. Y'all know I'm Haitian. Maybe I don't. But I'm Haitian, so we love plantains. But this is this is really, really good. I got to let my mom get try that, too. I saw that when I first got in there while I was getting all the other chips. Um, damn, it's a lot of chips. I didn't think that went through, but you know, listen, I have children, so these look like a good little, you know, snack in case I'm craving something sweet and savory. This is for me, but it's also for my daughter because she loves Cheetos, so I figured we can get her a few different kinds because she's addicted to this because I had a lot of it while I was pregnant too, but she loves Cheetos, so I just bought her some um, healthy options, you would say. Um... So she doesn't nag too much because I don't think the box has, nope. The one that I got them this time does not have Cheetos in it. So she's going to freak out. But such is life. We're trying to eat better and eat more at home. So also got a case of water. I'm going to put all this stuff up and clean up and we'll call it a day.
frosty. Frosty, Sammy. And it's a carrot cake. Carrot cake. And what's this? Um, juice. Oil. <laughs> Oil. <laughs> Audio? Yeah, we, it's about to go down. Pull it. Push that, put that down. Yep, there you go. Just push it back a little bit so it won't fall. You don't have to take the whole carton out. Uh, go ahead, just pull it, pull it. And then open it. Go ahead, one. One. How many do we need? Two. Nope, Three. we need, yep. Yeah. Yeah, mommy. No, get the ones that are in the same line. This one? Oh, right here, mama. Right here. You drive in my car. Okay, cutie. Girl. One more. Good job, my baby. Thank you. You're Three. I'm a big girl. Yes, you are. Yeah. Who said that? Bria said that. I'm just gonna get you some scissors, okay? Okay. Oh my mama! Oh, oh my, my mama! Oh my mama! Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> Ooh, this is my daddy. Isn't this my mommy? This is Bria. This is mommy. This is me and this is mommy. 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 You gotta pour it into the bowl, okay? Okay. Good job. Mmm, that's good. They have real carrots in it, or whatever. Mmm, yummy. So we didn't need to use the carrots or buy them. Mmm, yummy. <laughs> the sugars are like. That's the is. cake mix, Bria. Yeah. Let's make a castle. This castle shaking is a big bowl. Can we use it? Not the mailman at 7 o'clock. <laughs> Wait. Mommy, can we use the eggs? Yes, Mommy's probably going to crack them because I don't want you to break anything. Why is my room door open? No, hmm. it's not open. It's closed. It's definitely open, darling. Time for the milks. Yes. We need three fourths. Yes. All right. Let's see. Not a lot. Yet. Okay. We need poets in the bowl. And. Go ahead. Good job, the big yell. Oh, go to milk. and chicken. Mm, yummy. Okay, that didn't work the first time? Yeah. You breading and bean. Whoa. One. Two. Go ahead. <laughs> One more time. Yeah. One more time. Got it. Crack. Good job. Mommy, I see that. I see that baby egg was cracked. The baby egg. Oh, Lord. Mommy, we'll go. Big little egg. Mommy, we'll go. Okay, one more. Mommy, we'll go. 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 Mommy, we Mm -hmm. We can make something cool. We love it, eggs. Is the water broken? Get off. Where's all this water come from? Let me see. Is it this or something else? This. Where's that from? Did you drop water? Nope. That's me. I'm just getting that kid. No, I don't them up. Let's see if it builds another puddle. Third of a third of that. Yeah, we need this one in him. Mm. Mm. 
right. Thank you for your help, girl. You're welcome. Never laugh. What's my update yet? Hold on. Never laugh, mommy. Now we keep it in the foundation but Ooh, this brush of bows in here. Go ahead. Is it heavy? Nope, not too heavy. Good job, thank you. You're welcome. Ooh, it's smells Can I you please come get the stuff out of the oven? Thank you. It smells so yummy. It smells yummy? Yeah. It smells like cookie creams. Smell like cookie creams? Yeah, it smells like cookie creams. You made that up? Huh? You made that up? Yeah. I'm shaking it all up. Ziggy, hmm? look at all the eggs in there. And look in here. Ooh, that looks good. Yes. Do you like giving cakes? Yes, I like giving cakes. These cakes are so yummy. Cakes are so yummy. Ooh. Let me eat. Ray, be careful, please, before you drop everything. See, this is cookie cream. Now it's cookie cream. Yeah, we had cookie. Not cream. It's cookie creams. Are you sticking your tongue out? Not a dirt. I just like it. Okay, here. <laughs> Taste it. Taste it. Mmm. It tastes so yummy. <laughs> Zai, can you please come get me some more milk? It's a little thick. Huh? Can you please get me some more milk? I hate when you hum me. Because I know you heard me. What do you call her name for? I gave it to her. Get closer, Zion. All right, all right. Hopefully, listening to Tati wasn't a bad idea. Not even look. For what, baby? Give me up. We're about to put it in the oven. So it's gonna rise in it. Wow. Yes, I am. Oh. Wow, sorry. Huh? 
How long is this supposed to go for? 30 minutes, I think. This is ghetto. Can you go help her, please? Yeah, I got crazy towards the end of the night. It's well needed with a little slice and a couple scoops. Yep. Mm -hmm. Good night. It looks good, too. They'll get their piece tomorrow. Everybody was acting up. So I'm the only lucky girl. Yeah. Again, good night. And that's all. Okay, for the last time, again, night. It's finally Friday, so that that's a plus. It is Friday, and I'm annoyed, to say the least, with my children. Yes, they didn't ask to be here, but I am truly annoyed. Being a single mother sucks. I watched TRJ's... Um, video the other day and she said the same thing and I'm like sis I agree like we be like so quick to not say things like that because you know children are blessings be, you know people be losing kids and etc etc but I have the right to feel how I feel like why are you guys getting on my nerves since yesterday each and every one of them tried me one's getting first off my oldest is 18 why are you getting calls from school about you not getting your stuff done at school. This is your last year of school. What like what is the point? Why are we even having this? I spoke too soon. Plus I like he is spoiled beyond belief. Like it's bad. So I had to put my foot down finally. It took a very long time, obviously. Cause he hadn't been giving me like, you know, serious issues like the middle one does. But I had to be like, nah, you're not doing this, you're not doing that, you're not gonna work. Because you can't focus on school, there's no way you're going to be able to work, bro. Because now you're going to be like, oh, I got to get to work on time. And I'm gonna just going to miss my last period of class or something. No, no, no. Your you're focus is school. Forget about the job. Forget that you want to be fly and eat out every day. I told him, that's a dub too. I buy groceries, eat at home. You're literally eating out every single afternoon. I, mean, I vented to all my friends. I just think, you know. I just have to get it out here because I did not want to not show up today because I said I would do this every single day. And, yeah, that's a dub. Your focus is school. And if it's not done and done properly, you're not going to get to do those things. That's a, that's, it's a wrap. So I had to be like, mm -mm, no more eating out. When you get your grades up, I'll think about giving you back your little food money to eat breakfast or whatever after I've already purchased grocery items. And sis does not get food stamps with her three kids because I make too much money. And you know what? I'm fine with that because I'm not going to diminish my funds for the sake of food stamps. Anyways. So I get a phone call for him yesterday. Just now I get a phone call for kid number two. Mm-hmm. Which is expected. I'm surprised. He said it's been a reoccurring thing. And now he got detention. Guess who got to go pick him up after detention? And I hate going to his school. If His school is a zoo. Upon dismissal, whatever. Granted, the time that he has to get picked up for um, 
from the tension it's usually a little calmer. But now I gotta race against the clock because I have to get him and my daughter from school at the same time. It's, it's always something. Or I have to pick her up first and then rush and go get him from detention and then try to make it home for job number two that I start at five. But I get off at 4.30, by the way, from job number one. Make it make sense. Make it make sense. Me talking about this reminds me I have to tell his after, actual after school that he won't be there that day. Yeah, I'm I'm frustrated because I, I I know majority of it is is my fault, but sticking to your guns is kind of hard because then when you're like, oh, you can't do this, you can't do that, you know what they do? They come bother me. The older one, not so much, because he's not pretty much he's not in my face as much as the other two, but they're in my face. So it's like, damn, give him back the phone. Damn, let him play his game. Cause now, no, mm -mm, that's over with. And they have a long weekend this weekend. So why did y'all try me on a long weekend? I had to take everything away from the oldest one or everything that affects him minus his phone. I was going to say that, but I'm like, that sounds, that sounds like I'm talking to the middle one. So I'm like, man, not your phone. I'm going to take the bread away that I give you to eat. And the second one, I'm just going to take his phone away because he hates that. And he's not playing video games for the weekend. He was so happy about his long weekend. There goes that buddy. And you're going to have to suffer that consequence. All the way to tonight. Mind you, he was trying me last night too, but we're not going to get into it. Because this is just things that he just, you guys will probably hear forever that I talk about with him. It's a never ending battle. Such is life. Single motherhood is ghetto, for sure. It has nothing to do with the way I love them and care for them. It's ghetto here. A zero out of ten, I do not recommend. But I'm going to go find me something to eat. I'm supposed to be going to the off into the office today to enroll some patients. I'ma gather myself. We'll deal with the rest of it when I get back home later. I'ma go set breakfast up and I'll get back to y'all. We're in the kitchen. We're in the kitchen. Seasoning some chicken. Is that how it go? No? Okay, cool. So I just realized as I was sitting there, I was like, first I'll get up and go make this food. Um, that I was aggravated earlier, right? With, and I just started, first of all, I had said that I wasn't going to buy anything this month. For the month of October, I was going to relax. So I didn't, I had mentioned something about, uh, something that I'm addicted to buying. And it's sneakers. And clothes, of course, too. And guess what I don't do? Go outside. So what am I buying the clothes for? What am I buying all these shoes for? It's really like childhood stuff. Like when you grew up, first off, I'm Haitian. I don't know if I mentioned that, but I grew up with a mom. She's not cheap per se, but she just don't see the value in the things that we spent our money on, right? Understandably, she says that. She complains about it. And, but she shops for things that are like cool to her. Like she likes to buy sheets all day and towels and stuff like that. So I tell her, Yes, yours may be a little cheaper than mine, but it's the same thing. You spend the money on things that you truly don't need, right? Hey, we'll agree to disagree. But I just realized that as I was sitting there just now, like when I'm aggravated or pissed off or annoyed, I go to look for something to buy. It really just, re like I literally started, I was watching, I don't know if y'all heard it in the last video in the background, I was watching Bronny, who does like um, fashion stuff and all this extra stuff. Beautiful girl. And she was posting things. Oh, let me go grab the stuff that she buy. Girl. You don't need none of that stuff. You didn't need anything that she had up there. You probably don't even fit it. So I was like, see? This? But I've noticed it and I didn't do it. I didn't buy the things. I didn't need anything. I just hopped on Zara's site, which I've been addicted to because they actually have like fire jackets and stuff like that. Um, But... I was like, you didn't need nothing from Zara. You just heard her say that. Now you want to go check on the side. Mind you, I got two items that I have to return while I'm out today. Because Zara's not too far from my job. But I really realized that. And I think this is how you, you work on things is by acknowledging it yourself. People are going to point it out anyway. But I, my friends talk about my addiction to sneakers all the time. Some of them feed off of it. Some of them 
send me the shoes, some black girl, you don't need it. But um, I realized that I do run to shop whenever I'm aggravated. So I didn't do it. So I have to keep my word in that aspect. Eating out, no eating out, no shopping. I was going to buy me some perfume though yesterday. Just put it on my Christmas list. That's what Christmas list is for, right? I'll put it on there. That Dawn. Dawn, I'm moving by here by Brown Girl Jane. I have I have bought the sampler set. I kept three and gave away the other three because they're a little strong and like musky. I don't know. I didn't like in the last three. But Dawn, Bahia, and Lamu. But in, in order, Dawn, Lamu, then Bahia. Dawn? A1. A freaking one. Alright, so let's get to the point of me being in this kitchen. Tradarius Joe. Alright, how many am I supposed to have? Two. I'm gonna slice them in half so it looks like more. And put these in the air fryer. I'm gonna fry two eggs and I'm actually gonna put it on. A slice. Damn, I'll add all these for my shortness. A slice of this um pumpkin brioche toast. Because these slices are big. Oh, serving size is one slice. So perfect. I'm gonna have one slice. 190 calories. Whatever. YOLO. I'm gonna aggravate it. I could be eating outside and eat McDonald's. So I'm gonna put that fried egg. We can toss some spinach and tomatoes to make it a little jazzy. Yeah, we'll do that. So it's gonna be spinach, tomato, egg, cheese, and sausages. I'll be back when it's done. I don't think I'm gonna show y'all frying no damn eggs, and those are going in the air fryer. So. Been there, done that. Wrote the book. So I probably won't bring, I mean, I will bring the fruits with me and I'll probably grab some more snacks just in case. So I'll probably have those on the way and then have the other snacks on the way home because I'll probably leave around lunchtime, but won't have time to make, it's 1044, ain't no damn lunchtime. If I, when I come back from work, cause it's probably gonna be like an in and out thing. Um, probably not even an hour. I'll see what I want to eat when I get home. I probably won't, I won't lie about that. Um, We'll go from there, because I have some stuff to do today. We actually have to empty out Ziggy's room, because the walls are getting repaired. I'll show you what it looks like later. Good morning. Oh, no, it's not morning no more. How time is it? Shit, it's 1.09 p.m. On October 8th, um, I didn't come back, I don't think, after the mess that I showed you. I don't think I did. Um, I managed to get all of it done, went through stuff, bagged stuff up, this old pack, put stuff in these, um, I can show y'all. See that? Those are like little under the bed storages that we can use. That's mine with work clothes in it. So I don't wear them as often as I wear everything else. I reorganize my room. I have a couple shoes to put away, two boxes to put in the closet. And then I'm gonna wipe everything down, change my sheets. And I think we're done. It's very early in the day. So I do have to cook dinner today, which is fine, but I'm getting the laundry done. My room's done cleaning. Hopefully Ziggy's cleaning his mess that he made in the other room because there's mattresses in there. So they're just playing around in it, which is fine. But I just want order so that way when everything's done with his bedroom, we can put everything back together. I didn't get to show the hole that was put in there. And he's bouncing a ball instead of cleaning like I asked. Um, the, wall were, the walls were replaced yesterday. Um, so all that's left to do is to paint. And I'm going to have to wash the floors a few times, which is okay. Um, but again, I'm just trying to manage and coordinate everything on the outside of the room. That way when we go to put things back, 
things are in order. I did have a... Did I speak about throwing the bunk bed away? It's gone. So I bought them some metal platform um, frames for each mattress to go on and we'll go from there. I just need space and I need to be able to see if there's any mess tucked under the bed. Everybody's snacking in there, which will be an issue moving forward. Um, well, it has been, but that's a story for another day. Number six, breakfast. I just made something to eat at just now. And it's English muffin. There's some turkey bacon in there. It's a little burnt, but it's okay. And then I made me a little parfait. There's some blueberries and strawberries in it. And that's um, almond butter clusters with some vanilla yogurt. Seems like a very sweet treat, but it's better than chocolate and or gummy bears, whatever I like to eat. Yeah, so I have a couple light tasks to finish up. And we'll see what the day holds. I don't have any deep cleaning to do today. And the kids are off tomorrow, but I just want to get everything done tomorrow, today, so I don't have to do anything tomorrow, because I do have to work one of my jobs tomorrow. Yeah. So I'll check back in a little later. You get out? No, that's boring. Why are you touching me? I can't see you. Good. I didn't touch you, You know who you got your vision from? Your daddy. That's why you're blind. <laughs> no, the barbie. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that laugh is so annoying. <laughs> Bria, can we go wash your hair, please? Huh? Can we wash your hair? No, the barbie. We're not washing it tomorrow. You need it done by tomorrow. To later. Later? Later. Are you going to do it later? Yeah. It's an on. Oh, it's wet. <laughs> <laughs> what did I do to deserve this? I carried you for nine months. I take care of you. <laughs> Why are you guys bothering me? I just want to relax and do nothing today. All right, get out. No. No. All right. He's getting his fifth lineup for the month. Stop bitching me! What? What? Yes, I sent the $20. Because that's all you care about. Alright, get out. You what? What do you know about Jordans? We, we just put it on. Who? Me. What's sick of it? Where we put it on the shoes? Oh, the new ones? Yeah. The new ones that we got? Yeah. The eights? Yeah, the eight one the Jordan shoes we bought. You bought it? Yeah. You have money? Mm, yes. And it, um, it have two money to have to run the money. Mm -hmm. And we have a card to shoes. Mm -hmm. And we just buy it. Okay. Get new shoes, and we do just go back home. Okay. Dinner. Dinner. I made two bags of those. Those Trader Joe's Korean. Korean short ribs. Two bags. It comes with like six pieces and some corn. Y'all. There's a little bit of rice left from another meal that we had. That's for the kids. Can we have rice potatoes? And Stop doing that. Chicken? My plate. Damn, that shit look hefty. But all I had today was breakfast that I showed earlier. And those pirate booty ass chips. Oop. From Trader Joe's. Yes, Bria. I didn't your plate. Yeah. That's you. What's like that? That green, that green plate. That's the macaroni. I like macaroni. Yeah, that blue is the flower that they had to decorate I the plate. Like is it good? Yeah. You like the food? Yeah. Oh, okay. I like macaroni. Oh, great. Tell me something. Yeah. Tell me. <laughs> Why are you just coming? Bria. Huh? Bria, come here. Your breath stinks. <laughs> you are an elephant. <laughs> <laughs> the first one was the funniest one. Tell me a 
that question? That question? <laughs> what? A mummy? Yeah. You're, you're a grandma. I'm not a grandma. <laughs> okay. You're a mutant. Okay. <laughs> good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. I just realized that I have not introduced myself properly. I can't see y'all because the sun. Let me stand right here. Oop, right here. So I could block the. Then my head goes missing. I have not introduced myself. Every time I jump on this camera, like, who am I? But, you know, I'm not true to this. I'm new to this. So, I am Millie. That's why it says Mac you with Millie. Come Mac with me. Come Mac with me. Come Mac with me. Yes. That's so cheesy, but guess what? I love my Instagram handle and stuff like that, but I just didn't want to name this page that. Just in case I get up one day. And change it again. Like, who am I? Who do I think I am? Are you guys supposed to just assume? Like, you know what I'm saying? So I'm Millie. I am a mother of three, two boys, one girl, ages 18, 10, and three. Yeah. Y'all have seen the kids, obviously, but yeah. Um, I don't think I've introduced them, introduced them, but you know, that will happen. I'm sorry. <laughs> So I need to not watch YouTube videos. <laughs> oh, will I record? But yeah, so this morning started a little cool. Like I woke up like four-ish. I don't know if that's like, I had to sit down and be like, God, why you keep waking me up around this time? Makes me a little nervous. Um, But such is life. Uh, I'm sure there's a reason behind it. Maybe he's trying to be like, girl, get to the gym or something at five. I thought of that. Um, Not this morning, luckily, because... When I got outside this morning to drop Riri girl to school, my tire was flat. And I was driving bad serious to hit the corner. I was like, well, what's that sound? I sound like my tire. Mm hmm it sure did. And it was, when I hopped up the car, I was like, oh, you flat, sis, you flat. That fucking, ooh, that freaking tire literally be going flat all the time. So now I called AAA. I was, no, I was going to drive to a tire shop, which would have been, First off, I dropped her off at 745. School traffic and work traffic and all that. Alexa, light on. Um, with school traffic and all that, it would have definitely been embarrassing. I hate being embarrassed. This light is bothering me. Alexa, light off. So, with that being said, yeah. So, I was going to, um, I, what was I saying? I hate being embarrassed. So the, my friend, I had called her for support. I'll cuss her out later. Um, she's like, just throw your hazards on to bring attention to myself. Who the hell wants to bring attention to yourself? So I literally got in the car. The car was parked in the back. I got in the car and I parked in the front. I was like, I have AAA. So I jumped online, checked the car. Didn't have my actual car. My sister has my car and I have her car for whatever reason. And then... um seen that our cars was active nothing expired so I, I hit them i must do the application application the roadside assistance thing online and it was saying something about towing my car i was like mm -mm, i don't want my car to get towed mm -mm. so i went back and it was like there has to be a way to finagle it and they was like do you have a spare tire to be honest with you i've had the car for 10 years and maybe i do i've never used it i should right it's in the trunk up under that thing yeah so i have not used it or whatever um it was one of the kids who's still here asking about his stupid ass glasses. It's not my fault he can't see. Mind you, I bought him a pair of Ray-Bans for Christmas. Guess where that? In two pieces. Then he had a spare, extra pair of glasses that he was wearing. The, prescri bleh, the prescriptions aren't up to date. Where'd he leave that? At school in his locker. So he's walking like this. He can't see nothing. He can't see me. He can't see this. He can't. He's walking like this. Who does that? So now he's texting about these glasses. So now I got to go rush my entire life to get him some glasses that I already got him not even a year ago. And I'm not buying him Ray-Bans again. You're 18. You better get a job and figure it out. Because I use my good flex spending for that. 
But anyways, yeah. So I ended up doing a little application. It said, do you have a spare tire? Boop. I was like, yeah, sure, whatever. People showed up minutes and he came and he checked. He was like, I don't think there's a nail in there. I think you just have a slow leak. Um, probably when they went to put the tire, which I did get two front tires changed in May of this year. He said there's like a sealant they're supposed to put to prevent like between the rim and the tire. That's supposed to be sealed. And he's like, make your way there and see what they say. It shouldn't cost that much. But I'll deal with that on my way to work. So now it's looking like, let me go get something to eat. Because he's not about to stop whatever I got going on. Where's my work phone? Anyways, um... Get me something to eat because I need to eat breakfast because I was really going to make my way to Starbucks. But I already messed up and bought myself a pair of sneakers this month. And I had said I wasn't buying any. But I definitely did. Um, wrong shoe. But these are fire. Mm -hmm. That one just hasn't been placed in the closet yet. That was here. That was ordered before I said no sneakers. It's these, and then the Jordans that are here were ordered before then, too. I think. Yeah, they were. Um, those are the eights that's in here. Oh, can you see them? The Vomero, Vomero's, Vomero Fives. This is my fourth pair. But I did buy one. One of them I wanted to wear. I wanted the pink one. You ain't no pink, girl. And if you are, you would go on the darker end, not the lighter end. So, um, I opted out of that option, which they weren't even expensive. They were sold out, but they weren't expensive. I usually, if I need something really, or like something really bad, I'll just pay resale for them, and it wasn't even that hot. But I ended up getting the burgundy and pink ones of that. I got that color. I got a blue one, and I got some red, black, and, like, silver ones that I figured I'd work out in because I don't think I would wear them casually. I probably would wear those casually, but we'll see how I feel when I get back to the gym. I was supposed to start that on the first, but I really lack, I was going to say motivation. Motivation is not the issue. It's discipline. And, um, I used to love being in the gym. Maybe I just need to start going back with my sister, but she's been on this. Girl, if you ain't ready at this time, I'm leaving you and she'd be dead serious. Mm hmm She did tell me to wait for her when she got back from Miami. She has a great support system. So I wanted to walk and do us. It's cold now. It's cold in Boston. So back to the gym we go. But I kinda want to go at five. So I'ma see if the Lord continues to wake me up at this hour. But I realized that I'm probably waking up because I'm eating late. Which is another issue that I have to battle through. And it wasn't because um I didn't eat yesterday. I ate too late. I started to eat at like one. Which which messed me up because it sets me back. I literally saw something on Instagram about that too. Um, um which they were saying, like, yo, your body's moving slow or slowing your metabolism slow because you don't eat breakfast early enough. And look, it's about to be ten o'clock. So I'm about to, it's 9.30, I'm about to try to eat, make some oatmeal, which should be quick and painless now, and go from there. Who calling me? Oh, I got an appointment. I'll be back. All right, location change. Y'all are in the seasoning cabinet. Okay, so I don't think I have to go in the office today. Oh. What? Why are you like somebody's bothering you? You are. What are you coming down here for? I don't know. I, I hope you're eating. eating. So you need my eggs? No. What are you, what are you about to make? I think there's a bagel up there that can hold you over. There's some brioche there's bread. bread. There's bread. There is bread or there isn't? Right. Bread or whatever. Make sandwiches then. Egg sandwiches? Yeah. There's bacon in here. There's some turkey bacon. Salem. Get out, Salem. That was, he ain't loyal for nothing. Get out. Get out. Get out. Shoot. Let me close my room door. What are you looking for, dog? You're not about to take my...
my mayo upstairs. I knew it. Your what? Mayo. I knew it. Because you're never going to bring it back. I am. They didn't mark your accent yet. Did you, do y'all sign up for that college stuff? Yeah. Oh, I so they... another guest for Northeastern because I didn't want to go to UMass Boston. Where's the boys going? They're going to UMass Boston. Darwin's somehow going to Holy Cross. He said that last minute. So. How many schools can y'all visit in a day? One. That's it? Yeah, it's a certain time. It's uh, one thirty three fifteen. For you? Yeah, for Northeastern. Where's Northeastern at? My Ruggles. Oh, okay, 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 okay. By where the Cordobas and stuff is. Okay. Yeah. All right. Twenty dollars. Who left you twenty dollars? My man. There's a whole heap of trash that have to go out tonight. Nope. You'll be here. No, I was probably gonna go hoop after school and go to the girls' game because they play at six. Well, you need to hoop them grades up. Them grades come up because I seen your ELA grades was going down. ELA? And then went back up. Whatever that. Yeah, yeah, I went to. It went from a 92 to 89 to a 90. Yeah, I saw. Because they notified you every three seconds every time they change it. What is that? I don't get notified. Why? You don't have the app? No, I have the app. I just have to refresh it. Oh, you should do that. All right. Before I was rudely interrupted. We gonna do that. Yeah. I hope I really don't. I don't have to go in. She said the meeting's over Zoom. I'm gonna opt into the Zoom option. Why would I drive all the way over there knowing I already had a little, a little bit of car issue, which is rectified. But they don't need to know that. Call too. If I don't do that, you might need to next week. And I'm not doing that either. Because Bria girl going to be home next week. Yeah, I'm going to go get breakfast ready. And probably take him to go get his fitted for his glasses. The cheapest one we could find. If you cared about style and how fly you was, you would have picked a good pick. I mean, you would never slept on top of your pair. Boy, did you see him? He slept on top of, of some Rabians. Prescription Arabian glasses. Did I mention how cold it is? And I always feel like, tell me if I'm bugging, the inside of the house always felt a little cooler. What was that? A little cooler. Then I was, oh, it does have the chia seeds or whatever. It might be flex. Oh, the thing is called flex plus, you ding back. Let me see. Let me check the other box. Because I know I ain't fucking. You know what the issue is? I always use the flax seeds in like powder form. I don't think I've ever seen them in seed form. What? A... But yeah, it feels like, yo, much, much cooler inside the house than it does outside. And I'm, I'm dead ass not turning this heat on. I'm not. It's only October 10th. My mother's birthday is tomorrow. Um, yeah, um, I'm not turning that heat on. I promise y'all almost did yesterday. I was like, girl, you better put some socks on. Wear some clothes to bed because I don't do that. So that's why I probably felt cooler. But I made sure um, Bria has socks on. Ziggy's, a, he don't even want to wear a shirt half the time. So that's going to be my purchase at when I'm done with this no spending stuff, is to get them each more like pajama pants and stuff. Um, she's, I think she's good, but he might need a couple bottoms. He probably won't even wear them in full, so I'll be wasting my money. But I'll ask him before I purchase, because I need to know that, are you going to wear them? Because sometimes he'd be like, yeah, because his sister has, she wears full pajamas, because she doesn't fight me at night. Why well, should fine. Time. And he late as hell. And we late as hell. Here, go talk to Nanu. Here. Go. So, late as ever. I'm gonna make that, um, what's that thing called? The chicken Caesar pasta salad. Seasoning some chicken thighs. And I'm also making tacos. Who do I think I am? But I don't want to cook for a few days. So we're going to make both of those. Both of those. 
both of those and it's seven o'clock. But it'll be quick. I'm put this in the air fryer and I make the ground beef and I already got the taco stuff prepped and sitting on the kitchen table. So we have some, probably wasn't, some salsa, guac, street tacos, light sour cream, and some cheese. Ground beef. That's for the pasta salad. Good old chicken thighs. Parmesan cheese for that, corn for the tacos, some ranch and Caesar, these beans for the tacos, and the romaine hearts for the salad. And I might throw a little bit of croutons in there too. And I think some cherry tomatoes. Let's get it. And this is that. They have the same color cell phone and have the same color as the same baby. They have the same color cell phone? Well, I think phone for sale. Oh. They're little baby. What? A pink baby lives in the pink house. And we had a white house brown. Shayla is salty right now. And have the same color. Making headway. Pasta's boiling. Bread's still telling stories. And now it's a second more. I am. Take this broom and um, dustpan out because I bought a new one. Since the, yeah, they ruined that one. I think I want to try this. Over the, um, what you call it? Over the chicken while it's sitting in the air fryer still? Put that sitting there while it's still hot, and then um, cut this up. And put, man, I can't wait. It smells good. There's the air bro. Chicken. I'm the ninja. This one right here. 
Uh, 400 for 10 minutes. Well, 20. Bread, please stop. This chicken smells so good. Okay, the pasta's in there draining. My dad hates me. Bria, please, mama. Bria, she just said stop and you're doing it again. Ooh, ten dollars. Huh? Still. And I gotta taste one for GP. Let me see. Mm-hmm. Bria. Bria. Zion, please go get in the shower and ignore her. No, you're not. You're not about to make her cry. Okay, can you not do it right now, please? Okay. Are you gonna eat tacos? Tacos? Uh huh. Ooh. I want everything. Um, mommy. Crispy part. Mommy. Mm hmm. We gonna get second kitchen mm -hmm. up there. Pardon, Mama? Huh? What did you say? We gonna get second kitchen. We have a second kitchen? Yeah. Oh, wow. That's big money. We got money like that? Yeah. Where's the second kitchen at? Any room? Oh, wow. We, we, we get to do this. Pardon? Huh? What'd you say? We want to do it. We don't need one thing I'm going to do is dirty a bunch of dishes. Good Lord. Just washed all of them. Why did you wash them? Why are you in my business? Why are you in my business? It was Jackie. My gut hanging out. What you doing? Really, Bria? Ooh. <laughs> Ooh. Just a little bit of the ranch. Fell out the ball. Yep. That's done. They can figure that out. So we good. We should be good for a few days. I think they can make that on their own. And they can have a little bit of this if they want to. And we good to go. What about it? I don't like it. I don't like it. You don't like what? My vegetables. You'd even eat the chicken. You just knew your brother was leaving, so you wanted to get out the kitchen. What? I'm not picky. That was dramatic. She isn't picky either. She wants to get out the kitchen because she's eating it. You didn't have to say you didn't like it. You could have said, I don't want to sit in the kitchen. Huh? Day after day. Yes. Hey. Go ahead, eat, eat. Really? Eating the chicken. Can you use your fork, please? Yes. That left hand of yours. Bri, use your other hand. She can't do it. <laughs> I thought you didn't like it. Girl! Are you done with the antics? 
Wait, you're faking. We all know that. <laughs> Don't touch me. You tried it. You tried it. No, 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 no. Come on, Brett. Come finish eating so you can go to bed, please. Stop for Help me. You took a bath? No. Huh? Well. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning, guys. <laughs> so, I gave her the option to um, get in the car or walk, and she wants to walk. So, which is motivation for me, too. It's, it feels warm in the house. I don't know because I, I did give in and turn the heat on yesterday. If it's from that. Not yesterday, last night. And I thought we turned it off after literally a couple hours. And it was not off. We was in here dying. Like around 12. Um, but yeah, I'm going to put my crop, throw my hoodie on. And I'll see y'all when I get back. Because I'm not like prepared, prepared to pack all these guys up. So I'm going to grab my headphones. I'm going to drop her off take a good walk but we're gonna start it from this door so i drop her off and then we're gonna take it from there which i used to do all the time walk the neighborhood like i could do the park and stuff but that gets boring it gets tedious is this done not move that brown girl jean oh it's on my christmas list on my Christmas list. I don't buy full size perfume, so I'm gonna put it on my Christmas list because I want those in full size. But yeah, um, what was I saying? Yeah, I could easily do the park. We have a park across the street that I usually, you know, lap circles and stuff like that. But because school is coming in, sometimes other schools use that park to for like PE and stuff. I don't feel like doing that today. I'd rather walk the neighborhood because it makes it way more enjoyable. So. We gonna do that, and I'm gonna check back with you. I'm gonna show y'all my steps and all that. I'm gonna check back with you. Let's see what we starting with. Ski. And today's my mom's birthday. I just realized that. Happy birthday, mommy. I didn't just realize. I just remember to say it. Happy birthday to mommy. Grandma. Yeah. Grandma's not here. She went to work. Yes. Typical Haitian. I have 786 steps, and that's just from inside the house getting her dress and getting myself dressed. I'm not even going to put sneakers on. I'm going to put my Salehis on, my Crocs, and we're going to go from there. So, with that being said, I'll check back in when it's breakfast time. I already know what I want to eat today, and I want to eat by 10 o'clock is the goal. Um, yeah. Tell people you see them later. See you later. <laughs> Bye. All right, we back like cook crack. More eggs. Those maple sausages I got from Trader Joe's. The walk was good. Let me prop y'all up so I can try to show you my watch. Forty nine minutes. About five hours so far. I'm at twelve. Got 6,000 stuff for the morning so far. Almost two miles. Yeah, we out here. They're good. All right, we're about to head out after this. Going to party city to get my mama some balloons. Let's see. First off, why are balloons so expensive? These three little freaking heels. Can y'all see them? Hold on. Let me get in the car. For that shit fly off. Three little balloons, yo. $43. They need to last as long until her next birthday. Shit. For freaking $43. For three balloons. Three big ass helium balloons and they blow it up for you but I'm in the wrong profession too. Highway robbery is at an all time high. Now what should I do? I still got like 10 minutes before Damari's glasses are done. That's what I did before I came here. I went and got my son's glasses. Well pick a frame out for him because I did put the prescription in yesterday. Um, 
She said 30 minutes for it to get done. It's 119. I dropped it off like right before one o'clock. And it's kind of warm in the car, so I don't want to buy the cake. And I go forget and run around and go do something else and it melts. I doubt it will, but it's, it's kind of warm today. We'll see. Cause I think that's all, no, cause I can go to get the cake and her flowers in one spot. And the glasses. So that's all that's left to do. Balloons, cake, and flowers. Yep. The way my memory be. Ain't no telling. But it is a beautiful day today. It is. It's feeling like almost 70 degrees. Let's see what my car is saying. It's 68. That was close. I'm sorry. 68 degrees. But it feel like. To you. Go ahead. We'll sing it to her. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday. Happy birthday. Happy birthday to you. Yay! It's 9.39. Damn shame. Yeah. Gotta have that too. Good night. Excuse the rain sounds. It's what works for Bria. Um, gotta find a video to watch because I'm tired. I'm worn out. I was ripping and running until about three o'clock. And this lady that ass went and did everything on her own. I didn't even record that because she caught me off guard because I was like going up there to get the cake and stuff for her. Luckily, I had put the balloons up and um, placed the floors and floors. What the heck is that? The flowers and vases. I'm like, why did you take it out? Why did you do that? Oh, well, who else would? Like, you don't even know who brought this for you. Who else would have done it? I'm like, girl, it's an expectation for me. We should have got you a cupcake. Just one. But that, the Whole Foods cake is so good. Did y'all see it? Oh, yeah, I recorded it. Yep. It was so good. Yeah, and I just ate at 9 o'clock, like I showed y'all. Work was busy this evening. Which is fine. Such is life. Gotta make my money sometimes, you know? Um, yeah, it was a long day. I've been at it since, like, I woke up, kind of. Yeah, I didn't... I sat in here for a couple of hours, and I was, I think, after 10.30. From 10 to, like, 3, I was outside. Bananas. Anyways. Tomorrow, I got my one-on-one manager in the morning. I had a lash. I have a doctor's appointment. Telehealth. And I got a lash appointment. Another busy day. But hopefully I'll be home. Nope. I think my lash appointment says 11 something to like 1.30. I hope she don't take that long. Shit. It's okay. Um, yeah, so another long day. Yeah. This bag is cute. Target by a new day. It looks kind of warm, but it's so soft. Yeah, it's cute. I seen some Uggs. That's gonna go real nice with these. I'm gonna add that to my Christmas list. Later, y'all. I just realized I didn't check in this morning. Yes, yeah, so what was I doing? I dropped a baby girl off. She made me walk, which is cool. I didn't get to finish the walk because I had a meeting. So I had to come back here for only the meeting to be canceled. No problem. Then hopped in the shower, got dressed for the day. Had a, what, do I, what did I have to do? I had a doctor's appointment, a weight management appointment um, that we had to do via video call or whatever that you have to do it before you start the whole process because I'm trying to gauge and figure out what is good with me as to why it just hasn't been working. Though I know what I've been doing wrong, I just need to know, you know what I'm saying? What has not been working? So cool. Um, we did that, Raina got my lashes in. Okay. Can I see it? Yep, got them refilled. Um, and then I just got back home. Now I'm gonna clean the curb because the room got done. Still not finished, but we're still waiting for some furniture pieces, but such is life. But I just need to clean around everything else because all that white dust and everything. 
So I'm gonna hopefully it takes about an hour or so to kind of get all the floors, get things picked up, put it in their perspective places. We're gonna go from there. I don't think I'm cooking today. So you probably won't see that. I don't know when I'm gonna come back. I ain't gonna hold y'all. I don't know when I'm gonna come back. Alexa, light off. I don't know. Okay. But the house looks crazy. We got a mattress sitting in here. It looks crazy, but that's fine. I am kind of hungry, but I feel like I just ate before I left. So I'm not going to do that. I probably do have some work to do. If not, I'll do it tomorrow. Um, I'll double check it. I feel like I didn't do a lot of work today, this week. But it, was, it hasn't been that busy either. But I think I should focus on cleaning and then... I'll figure out work later. Still got a few hours of that. But I feel like if I leave it, I'm not going to do it any other time. Or if I leave it to somebody else to do it, it's not going to get done. So. <laughs> the lashes are fire. I'm, uh, um, I'm trying to see. I had to order a new broom, which they left in the middle of the porch. FedEx. Um. What was I gonna say? Yeah, I had to order. Damn, I double chin with double chin. I ordered a new broom, but I'm about to go upstairs and steal theirs. <laughs> I want to use my new broom when I on these dirty ass floors. Wait till I, after I wash the floors and I'll use it next time. Yeah, with that being said, I'm gonna let y'all let me go. I head into the gym. The late is up. I'm supposed to start the class at 7:15. Taking a Zumba class. Uh, today's what Thursday I'll probably take y'all along on the Sunday class because that's not inside the gym um, I love this lady's class she's freaking bomb and I haven't been in a very 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 in months just, just be fair be in months the whole summer probably went like three times so I'll see y'all probably when I get out because I'm not taking y'all inside that gym bye so I'm back See, my watch died in the middle, not middle, like towards the end of the workout. It was great to say the least. I'm gonna show y'all my steps for the day. Okay. Maybe I should just turn it this way. Hold on. Okay. So they go the minutes, calories, my stand up. Let's see. Anything else? Does it show what I did? Let me see. It show more. I think my watch died and it might have played me. Well, these didn't come from no walk today. I definitely went. There should have been dance down here. And I think my watch died messed it up. But I was in there for like an hour and some change. Ain't that Obviously, you could tell right here my exercise minutes, but whatever. I'm salty right now. Dang. Oh well, it happened. It don't matter. I didn't save it. Such is life. I'm going to be good night. It actually came up on my watch, so I'm assuming it tracked it or saved it, but it didn't show up on my phone yet. So maybe I'll. Fat girl. Fat girl. Fat girl. Fat girl. Fat girl. Oh, that fat girl. Who's the fat girl? Me. Here's my gummies. Hi. Tell them it's Friday. It's Friday. Hey, mommy ain't do nothing today. Mm-mm. <laughs> Mom. I didn't do nothing today? No. How was school? Good. What'd you learn? My A with my numbers. Bria. Hmm? You three. You learned that a long time ago. I learned my A with C's. That's it? Yeah. Best gummies in the world. Best gummies in the world. Oh, well, it says world's best too on it. Bomb. <laughs> what? What? I had to clean this kitchen tonight. 
Are you done? No. What? And kitty cats are mine because I'm mommy Skyla is my best friend. Who? Skyla. Skyla. Yeah, she's my best friend. Oh yeah. She's going to kindergarten with me. She wants a kindergarten with you? Yeah. <laughs> Miami for, for um, Jamaica when I went to my friend's wedding. She calls me. No, she well, she tried to call me, but I was down. You like my what's intern you want? Alright, so I'm back. Ooh. Nails done. Yeah, that's done. I had a few videos on my phone from it, but I'm scary McGee right now, so I haven't I'm not brave enough to ask. And it's Saturday, so it's a little packed in there today. Okay. So, like I said earlier, I actually have something to do later. Have a little cannabis dinner thing going on tonight. So, um, I gotta pick something else to wear. Because I don't go outside like I should. Um, I have plenty of things to wear because I shop as if I do, but I don't. With that being said, I'm going to put something together. But it's nothing formal or too dressy. Um, I had these. When I open this, it's going to look so... First time, it looks small. Y'all know I'm a big girl. But it stretches, obviously. It's from Pretty Little Thing. It's some gray. It's probably going to be long on me because I'm short. Little flare thing going on. I'm probably going to throw on a graphic tee. But it's really like, which graphic tee? Or which shoe are we going to do? Right, put this away, because in the process, I'm going to put things back where they belong. I still have my luggage from Atlanta sitting here. I know there's no shoes in there. All right, I got the bottoms. Only because I rearranged certain drawers and things like that. I put all my work clothes in one of these little black storage, under the bed storage things. Because I don't have to dress up that often. So I could just, when Bria's playpen get out of here, which I got to wait another week for, um, I'll be able to move my bread over this way so I can store things on the other side. Because I already have two things of workout sneakers and sandals, shoes, store on this side. So I'm just going to put that on that side. But yeah, so it's just what shoe to wear. Or should I pick out the shirt and do it like that? I think pick my graphic tee drawers. Crazy. I have graphic, I have some shirts in here. This is green. This is cream. That's blue. Too cold for that. I don't want to wear white either because it's like a food event. It's Misfit tea. It's cute. My sister hates that I like wearing oversized tees, but I'm, I've been having some body dysmorphia. So I wear baggy stuff. Well, baggy tops. Which probably shortens me some more. It makes me look a little stubby here as well. It was not like that in here, but such is like. We're gonna check the other two drawers, but I think one drawer has all black and this one has, um, I can't wait to have me a walk-in closet where everything is just cute and laid out. Like this is neat, cool, but on either side, shoes are tucked in there and in pure honesty, I don't know what's on either side. I would have to literally take them down one by one so I don't knock the towers down to find what I'm looking for. Just like this drawer right here is kind of stuffed as well. I don't know what I'm going for. It looks like I might end up having to wear a little white. Something white or black. I don't want to do black. I'm trying to get away from it. Granted, it's fall. And I opted into a very neutral color, but I don't know. You know what I should start doing? Because I don't like to 
I need to say this so it doesn't sound nasty. I don't, I like to wear my shirts more than once before I wash them because a lot of my t-shirts are fairly expensive. Like this is a Supreme tee. Yes, I haven't worn it yet. But I would, if I went out like to dinner and like had a jacket and stuff over it and nothing happened to the shirt, I'm going to come home and take it off and put it back. I am. Yep. So I need to start moving the shirts I have worn down. What's this from? Fashion Nova. This is... This one, Fashion Nova, these ones were not sized properly because I definitely sized up. These are 3X in women's. I went too big. Definitely went too big on that. I've worn this Milano shirt as well. This one hasn't been worn. So that's going to go below that. Oh, this pink would look nice. Oh, and I don't make my bed for nothing. I be trying. I be thinking about it. I just don't. This is... It's a double X large too. By Stussy, Stussy, whatever. Another expensive t-shirt. Brand. I don't know how this ended up with this... The black stuff. This Dennis Rodman shirt. I've worn countless times. So let's put that under. Why am I organizing? Because I wouldn't be me if I didn't. Maybe the St. Perry shirt? Oh, St. Darius. Damn. Try not to be too matchy. Some light dark gray at the top. I'm not a matchy girl, so I probably will throw some random ass shoe with it. But this is a good option. It's not all the way black. It's a dark gray. I don't hate it. So we're going to leave that one out. And see if we can find something else. Or another contender. Oh, well, this would be fitting because I'm going to a cannabis party. Cookies is a, this is not cookies. This is grateful apparel. Okay. Wrong one. But I feel like I do have a cookie shirt. I don't even smoke weed. To be fair, I do not smoke. I do partake in some edibles here and there. I haven't had the greatest of experiences with them. But they haven't been horrible either. Fly Girl Mafia. These ones back in here. Watch the new nail says that'll be the one to yeah like that one. No. or oh maybe this one works a little better mm. Let me back up excuse this the floor it's the old house I think this is from PacSun, Urban Outfitters, one of them. Yeah, I think we should do the Outcast. Yeah. Mm hmm. All right, I'm going to put all this stuff back. I was going to rock this, but I said no black today. But I think they are a weed brand, right? Or advocate for it? I don't know. But I said no black for today. So I'm going to put this back. I'm going to put all these things back, and I'm going to go think about the shoes options because I don't want to knock all them things down. So we're gonna have to go think about what, maybe I should call my son down cause he might remember, he don't see all my sneakers though on a regular basis. So I don't know what, we'll see. I hit your back. Okay, I lied. There's still a couple of shoes in there. Flats I had brought to Helena. There was definitely a good pink tea in here. And all my damn bras. Not all of them, obviously. Some of the ones that I bought and didn't freaking like. This You aren't invited tea is cute too. Just not fitting for the moment. I feel like this is like a good summer, you know, biker shorts. I brought it to Atlanta. It was hot in Atlanta, so. Um we're gonna put that. You like my voice? Hey, turn me on. We outside. We outside. 
we're really going inside someone else's house. We but, are. yeah, we're prepared. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Let me see. Damn, can you see my shoes? No, oh, she's cute. Can't Wait. see my shoes. Yes. I'm like, do she need help? I just walked out. That's okay. I'm quick on. I don't have anybody. You like my voice? It, what is, you want, what is that? Me. It's all rosy and stuff. What was I, that? I, 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 Thank you all for coming out. 
I truly don't do that. Thank you. Uh, don't do that. Turn that light on. Stop playing with me tomorrow. Uh, I appreciate you all for coming out this evening. Uh, we haven't done this in a couple of years now. And the reason why that it was so important for me to do it is because this is the holiday season. Things get crazy. Everybody goes into their own family. Like, do a whole bunch of stuff. Yeah, I'm learning. It's still October. I know, but November is right around the corner. New Year's is like next week. What you mean? New Year's is next week. It really is. So with that being said, you, hey, you, hey, hey. With that being said, ladies and gentlemen. Sorry, sorry. You have to pay right now. Kendall. Thank you. The reason why this is important is so we have a moment in time to spend together. Mm. We've all experienced a lot of ups and some downs this year. Mm. But at the end of the day, we have so much to be grateful for. Amen. I am grateful because of you. You all make me the man that I am. You feel you overflow my cup. And that's a real thing. Hallelujah. And so I am thankful for everyone old and everyone new that is in my life. And I hope this moment you all can share some of that energy with each other. That is my hope and my prayer for you today and every day. So with that being said, Nate is upstairs. I just love you, man. Stop it. Good. Uh, so, <laughs> so I'll let him talk later, but I'll just tell you what's here. So infused on this table is the jerk salmon that has that's infused. So if you're not doing that, don't eat it. Um, the mashed potatoes. Has infused butter already on it, so if you're not into that, don't do that. Ow! Everything else doesn't have anything on it, but you can add it with the butter. Mm, all right. Um, there's also whatever it is in here with uh, marijuana or cannabis in it. Who would like one? I will bring it out. What did you say? Can we just do a quick cheers to Milton? No. General purposes? <laughs> yes, you gotta keep them going. You gotta entice them. Not freaking Ziggy watching some <laughs> right. <laughs> that's my, that's that that's that my old fans, yeah. and I was like, um, he changed that. <laughs> he changed He's like, so quick. that nigga know what the fuck going on, please. Of course. He's, He's like, like, <laughs> <laughs> like that's damn. My boy. Scary. Scary. It's my boy. <laughs> He's like, no, it's okay. the right one, but mommy's hair. So it's just unavoidable at this point. You desensitized, you know? <laughs> so word, of, word of the day, you desensitized. Don't play with it, don't be this size. Hey, 
still not understand.